welcome to your fun looks at the the Soviet Tier 2 Premium Light Tank, the T-54, or T-45, I always can't get his name right. I'm the Spawn, and we are looking at another tank in Wolf Tanks, and today we're looking at another gift tank, um, which is the, T the T-45, and let's go. Nothing else to say? Uh, by the way, well, there's something to say, you can, by the way, if, how you get this tank is by playing, is by winning a match in Wolf Tanks by the 15th of August, 2016, and by 7... 20, at 7.20 a.m., I think. So, yeah. It was first, it was first available August 12, 2016. Alright, Roomberg. Okay. But, yeah. Um, oh, yeah, I should mention, uh, this is not blind right now. Unfortunately, I lost my footage due to a silly mistake of actually deleting it. Even though I didn't have it selected to delete, I was deleting all my I was deleting my footage from uh, from last night because I was just clearing up my folder because I thought because for whatever reason the story. Well, let, let's tell you the whole story. All right, in the first recording, the first part went well. Cut for uh, cut for the uh, comparisons. Comparisons went well. You still see the comparisons, by the way, after I'm done with this match. Then when I went. You know, then I noticed that my recording wasn't in kidding when I was recording the second match after the comparisons. So I backed out after that match. Looked and saw nothing was wrong. So I looked at my videos, was going to see where it stopped recording, and unfortunately, uh, I deleted the first video while I was waiting for the uh, audio to separate from the video, which we are going this way. Now watch this thing accelerate. It gets to 15 immediately, and then it takes a long time to get to its stop speed. As you can see, but it was a really good blind match. But unfortunately, I accidentally deleted it. Again, it was like I said, it was, it was outside my selection box. I'm not quite sure how it got deleted, but I got deleted somehow. Um, but yeah, gun elevation, pretty good. Gun depression, really good for a Russian tank. Uh, traverse is good. And look at this smooth build; it's amazing. Oh, let's oh let's fight these guys. What? That's a good snack. Good, good thing we have rear armor. Not in the lag though. It's like right before I get hit. Okay, break off, break off. I hope I don't run anyone. That'd be bad. Okay, I thought we were safer. I thought they were too busy engaging our guys and they weren't on that front. Alright, we're good. Gotcha! Alright, so we can hit flat on because otherwise you can't hit these, you can't penetrate these guys with their own gun. Oh, uh, I'll wait for some guys to get in the way first. Like, them two light will work. Gonna use her. But as you can see, the roll time's really fast. Got another one? Oh, got another Hayden? Okay, so that guy. Ah, I would have got him. That one. Actually, they might not have got him at the Oh, we're angle. Oh, I was dying to him. Well, unfortunately, I either I either can play at. I When, when I'm aiming, I have to play at like 500 DPI. When I'm normal play is like a thousand four hundred, but unfortunately, since Miles and Wolf Hanks is not working well, but anyway, yeah, it was a good game. So showed up everything and then show off, and it got more damage in than my than the last footage. So that's good. So I'll be right back once. Uh, well, I'll be okay. Okay, now we're going to go into the um, now they're going to go comparison, which will be the part of the old footage. Uh, which by the way, uh, I didn't go over all of these, so yeah. You know, like I. Got got the comparisons from my um like since I do have do already have a T twenty six I put that up there put this up there and went down the trees looking at them so I'll be right back once I do the comparisons of course I'll be showing I'll be showing where I actually cut off which is the T two light so I'll be right back okay back so first off um let's compare it to it's um what's based on of oh wait. 
Um, where is that guy? And it is D60. Okay, the upgrade version is D60. Alright, so I might as well, you know, since, our, since this is an upgrade version D60, might as well do that first. And then we'll do direct comparisons of the G26. T7 Compact Car, since I don't have this, you know, since I don't have a uh, Micro Mouse, uh, the, I forgot what it's actually called, but the Micro Mouse, um, you look it up, you'll find it. Um, you know, I, I don't have it on, uh, I don't have it on PC, but Dodge gets to be good enough. Uh, and then going down in the sending order of things that I probably, yeah, just things they can compare it to. Alright, first off. The Light Tank T-45 has average shale damage of in between 35-59. Penetration of 38-64. Rear fire of 16.7. Gun reload time 3.6. Start to first speed 34. Gun depression elevation. Uh, neg the gun depresses six, negative 6 degrees. Gun elevates 20 degrees. Finally, I, I finally can figure I it understand what that means because it actually says it here i think i hope there i hope it means what it says i mean having the slide share makes sense but anyway all right but anyway aim time is 2.4 seconds dispersion 140 is 0.4 that's accuracy um uh, average human per minute 783 durability 104 140 hull armor 25 front and rear and 15 on the sides. That's interesting. You either face someone or you, well, you face someone or look over your shoulder at someone. You do not look to your sides. That's interesting. Uh, I mean, it's not, you know, it's like the M4 improved with its having insane amounts of side armor as opposed to uh, front armor. I think and it's slipped differently. Uh, then we got turret armor, all 35. Engine power is 85, specific power is 12.5. Top speed is 15 and going forward, and or is 41 going forward and 15 in reverse. Traverse speed is 54.12, uh, 54.24. Consumer of stationary vehicle 16, uh, 16.9 and 1.9, or two 1.9. Consuming on a blue vehicle, 12.7, or 1, and, I'm not quite sure what the slash is about, uh, 1.27. View range, 300, signal range, 300. Alright, it's the stock version of the original, which is actually of the same tier. It has a whole lot less damage, a whole lot less penetration, a much higher rate of fire, a sort of, uh... There's two under sword, sword trooper speed. It elevate it's elevates and the press is better. The uh, T60 does. Your load speed is slower, much slower. I'm looking at. Oh yeah, he, yeah. He uses a uh, he uses a uh, an auto loader. Uh, or not? Kind of not quite sure. The aim time is less. The dispersion is more. The sorry, I'm getting confused. I mean, done one of these a long time. All right, okay. The durability is higher actually, despite the fact that the despite the fact that the T45 is supposed to have more ha more armor. Huh? Where the T60 has more front armor, turret armor. Is less, but I guess I don't know. Maybe it mean it could mean this could mean just the turret armor, but I don't think so. Um, then you got the, the engine, and you got the uh, that engine power does matter. Uh, so, uh is less than the T45. Top speed is more than T4. T45, reverse speed is more, is less than T45. Uh, it is more stealthy. Uh, it is more stealthy. It has a less view range and it has the same signal range. All right. That's interesting. Uh, that is very interesting. Yeah, I mean, it has, you know, the T45 has one, has the, you know, it, one of, it has one advantage over the uh, T50. In fact, it has a better gun. Uh, but its front armor is less for some reason. That's weird. Uh, this, the T60 over here could be a newer version, but I don't think so. Since they're running replacements for the T70. 
you don't know anything about these things, and not, you know, I, I don't, I don't know anything about version vehicles at all, pretty much. I know that they had them, and that's about it. But anyway, moving on to my personal favorite of the tier twos, and one of my more favorite premium tanks, and one of my more favorite tanks of the game, the T60, uh, the T1E6. Now, the T1E6, the shell damage, has less penetration, has higher rate of fire, has sword traverse, has sword. Oh, that's what's getting me. They're different. Yeah, they're, they're, you know, they're, uh, give me, the, compar the comparison's getting me because they're different. They're listed differently for some other reason. I guess because auto loader and not auto loader. Or auto cannon, not, well, yeah, 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 the T-16 is giving me this not auto loader. And not auto, and not auto loader. Maybe we're going back to it. Alright, the traverse speed is on the T-45 is faster. Aim time is about the same with the T-16, believe I think more. Or less, I should say. Um, dispersion is more than the T1E6. Or accuracy is less than the T1E6. Uh, average of the T1E6 has much more. It's much higher one. The rarity, T1E6 has more, uh, has more health. Armor, T1E6 has less armor. All around. Turret armor is less. Engine power is more. Much more. Specific power is more. Top speed is more. Traverse speed is less. Concealment is a little bit less all around. And view range is less. Signal range is less. Alright. Moving on to its other comparable. I mean, comparable. Uh, you probably won't. If you see one, you know what. The, you, if you see one, you know, the, you know how your T44, T45, or your combat character compares to each other, but. Okay, you might not ever get a combat car. I wasn't quite sure, but then again, I could be wrong because I wasn't quite sure you'd be able to get a T-16 again, and you could actually buy it twice. Um, you know, in like uh, you know earlier in the year and last year, so yeah. Uh, but a T-7 combat car does less damage, does less penetration, has a much higher RFR, has a sort of burst speed, has a much better gun. To Compression elevation. Actually, go back to D when you say put your compression elevation. Oh yeah, much better. Except I've kept up it. Except that the uh, T45 is much better up than the T16 does. But yeah, moving on back to the combat car. Combat car has more gun elevation and more gun depression. I mean, but it's has a little machine gun. So yeah. Aim time is better on the T45. This version is more, uh, T45 is more accurate. per minute, the T45 actually has high, higher damage per minute. The health, uh, the T, the CE7 has more health. The T7 has less armor, T7 has less armor. Both in the hull and turret. The self, T7 has more engine power, has more specific input. Their more specific power. Ah, uh, is higher top speed, high, a lower traverse speed, concealment is about the same. Uh, it's actually a little bit less all around. Uh, view range is, is, is less and the signal range is less. Now let's compare it to the micro mouse. Depends on what. Uh, but yeah, the Hotchkiss has less gel damage, less penetration, higher rate of fire somehow. Uh... Yeah, these actually have a, it's it's an actual cannon, so uh, or it's a it's a it's a single shot cannon. Uh T T45 reloads faster. T45 has higher traverse speed. T45 has the same elevation but much less depression. T45 has or the uh, Hotchkiss has faster aim time. Hotchkiss is less accurate. Hotchkiss it actually Hotchkiss has lower damage per minute. Hotchkiss. Has more health. Hotchkiss has insane armor. Uh, except the T45 kind of matches it in the turret, but it still fights less. Uh, Hotchkiss has less engine power. Hotchkiss has less specific power. Hotchkiss has. Hotchkiss has. Slower, do slower speeds. Although his reverse speed is almost matching the T45. 
Hodgkiss. Character versus four. Concealment is actually about the same, oddly enough. Uh, but still less. And the range is going to do the same. Make sure to the T-86. Would you like in reverse? Yeah, the T-86 goes for in reverse. How about car? Go. I'm trying to find it. Goes, I go this 20 hours as well. All right. You know, let's still get more game in. Uh, since we did compare it to all the direct comparables, let's. Uh, I'm just going to go. I'm just going to go through this pretty quickly. Um, Panzer One. Only real advantage. It ha uh, yeah, Panzer One is. I play very terrible actually compared to the uh, T47, T45. Um, in every way, matchbox, much higher of fire. Almost the best turret traverse. Gun depression, or gun depression is much, gun depression is much better. Uh, aim time is actually faster. Higher, higher DPM. Actually, more health, oddly enough. Uh, less armor. And. Sword top speed. And reverse speed is worse. Sorry, right, moving on to the M2 light. Wait a second, we do have another direct comparable. My bad. Uh oh. Uh, let me look at the M2 light. Uh, I guess I know it's in the store. Okay, we'll look at it then. How about that? The M2 light tank. Or the T2 light. It's less damage, less penetration. Which I repair. Sword, uh, sword, turn traverse, but not by much. And very gun depression. Aim time. Aim time is. Aim time is faster. Dip dispersion is worse. Damage permanence. Uh, damage permanence is worse, but yeah, it's worse. Health is the same. Armor. It's actually better in the front. And better in the sides, and the same as the rear, oddly enough. Third armor is less. Top speed is much more, or speed is more. Traverse is less. He's a stealthy, but not by much. It has less few range and signal range. Moving on to the Panzer II. In the two, less damage, less penetration. Higher air, higher air of fire, traverse is faster. Aim time is faster, dispersion is worse, uh, durability is more, but by five. Hull armor is actually better in the front, but not in the sides and rear. Turret armor, nope, it's not, it, only the front turret armor, but nothing in the sides and rear. Even then, it's still five less. Uh, engine power is better, top speed is Actually, pretty much the same, except it goes one kilometer per second less than the T-45 uh, does. The reverse speed is less. Concealment, it is less stealthy, but not by much. And view range and signal range are... The view range is less by 10, and the view and the signal range is more by 23. Moving on to Hago. Hago! Actually... Actually, can give it a run for its money in terms of damage. They're very similar, but it's still less. Penetration is much, uh, yeah, it's much less. Yeah, fire is more. Reload time is a second less. Turret traverse speed it is more. Gun depression elevation is better, much better. Gun depression. Aim time is less. Dispersion it is more. I, uh, average damage per minute is more on the hog go. Ha uh, armor is not, not as good. Engine power is more. Pacific power is more. Top speed is almost ma is almost matching. Again, all top its top speed is off by one, but it's reverse speed same. Traverse speed is less, but not by much. Um, it's less, but by 10. Concealment is very similar again the hago is less by one and view range is the same signal range is better than the hago 
All right, moving on to the T-35. T-35 does around the same damage, but still less. Penetration is similar, but again, less. Rear fire is more. The load time is a second less. Crew traverse speed is less. Gun depression elevation. Gun depression is more. Elevation is actually more. Aim time is less. Dispersion is more. Uh, average grand per minute is more. Durability is more by 10. Armor is less. Engine power is more. Pacific power is actually less. Top speed is more. Reverse speed. Or top speed is less, I mean. And reverse speed is same. Reverse speed is less, but by 10. Concealment is almost the same, but again, off by 1. Uh, off by 1 in the T44 favor, or T45's favor. Uh, the range is more, uh, the B range is less on the T35, or the Panzer 35, and the signal range is more than the Panzer 35, falling by 2. Alright, last comparable that is not another premium that I didn't think of. Um, the Chinese tank has more damage, actually. Finally, he found something with more damage. His less penetration. As this for as more rate fire, has a load speed of 3.2, which is more or less. True traverse speed is less, gun depression elevation is better, aim time is better, dispersion is worse, average damage per minute is better, durability is less. Or the ability is more, I mean. Ha armor is worse on the Chinese tank. Engine power is more on the Chinese tank. Specific power is about the same on the Chinese tank. But then, or is slightly less than the Chinese, uh, slightly worse than the Chinese tank. Top speed is worse than the Chinese tank, but not by much. Traverse speed is worse than the Chinese tank. Concealment is worse than the Chinese tank, but not by much. A view range is actually worse on the Chinese Sigma not by much, and it's the same, and signal range is about the same. Alright, now let's go grab the T2 light. Because that is a direct comparable that I did not think of, or, I thought of it, I just, okay, man, okay, I'll be honest, I didn't think of it, I didn't think of it at all. Alright, anyone else, so we can direct compare? Now there's your threes. You get over here. Anyone else? Last call. Oh, I guess we're gonna done. No, yeah, yeah, this is the yeah the uh, British. Well, worry about wing repairing. So with the uh, French, they have so many light tanks. Okay, last tank to compare, and then we'll do another battle. All right, T2 light does less damage, has less penetration, has much higher rate of fire, has faster traverse, to traverse speed, has better gun gun depression and gun elevation. Aim time is better, dispersion is worse by one, average move per minute is more, durability is actually more. And it's the T2 light, the thing, the fast light tank. It's meant to be really, really fast light tank. Uh, nothing else. We're getting to that right now. Uh, hull ar the armor is not as good, the engine power is much more than the T45. Um, uh, spit power is a whole lot more than the T35. Or T or T fifty four. Top speed is insane compared to T forty four. T forty five. Traverse speed less than T forty five. Concealment is less on the T two light. T range is less than T two light, and signal range is more than T two light. All right, that's interesting. Okay, and like I said, one more battle. I mean, our first battle was good. Our first battle was really good, so let's do it again. And let's hope we can actually get a match with any reasonable time, because again, a lot of people are playing this thing right now. So this is actually not really. Again, this is the same category as the T twenty six in terms of how awesome this thing is. Um, now, now story. A little history lesson in case you're watching this in the future or just haven't been following. Or you just haven't been following Wolf Tanks. Um, now, in Mo now Wolf Tanks been having issues with its with its low-tier gift tanks. As in, uh, 
tier three and two. People have been complaining about how they're being abs how they're absolutely ter terrible tanks, and when they say that, they look at the Toldy. Um, this tank actually broke that pretty hard because it's a really amazing tank. Again, it's in the same category as the T uh, T twenty six in terms of how awesome this bl this blasted thing is. Um, so yeah. Oh, by the way, I should also mention Gates here new to my channel. You really gotta pull my leg. In, you really gotta pull my leg in order for me to say any, any Russian thing is amazing, which is odd because actually, uh, in my analytics, I actually see that Russia is actually like my third or fourth mo most popular. I uh, like most. My biggest group is actually my biggest viewership is actually in Russia. It's my third or fourth one, oddly enough. Uh, I mean. 33% around the around 30% is America. The rest are and it just split by bit and the rest is split throughout the entire world basically. So yeah, um, well I don't mean anything against your people. I just mean stuff against your government and your uh, things, which I do like Russian music, but yeah. I mean I do like your Kurnovs, the subs. I do like your insane carriers. I do like your AN-94. And I gotta pull my leg for anything more, because I, I, I can't think of another one. Alright, here we go. But, but don't worry, I, don't, I like British things as equal, and I don't like anything British. But now, when I think about it hard, I don't like anything British. Um, I like Russia, but I find that something's cool. Alright, let's go. Oh, let's go to the that way. Yeah, let's go this way since we're close to it. All right, here we go. Forward onto the enemy, we shall go. Oh, bye, Bison. Is that running me? Um, 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 actually, yeah, I move up to this, this position. Don't think about anything else. Yeah, I really gotta look at this Atlas Coloration because it's weird. It takes forever to get to its top speed, but, like, watch. Yeah, it gets to like 15 in the second. It, not there a second. It's an interesting tank. Hello. Um. Yeah, let's get after this guy, the T15. Or no, another one of us. Hey, that's what happened. Apparently, that's what happens when gift tanks. Oh, and we're getting leg spikes. Oh, we're getting massive leg spikes. That's not gonna help matters. Ow. Oh, is this good? Good part. Okay, we bounced off each other's armor. That's good enough. So, aim to the turret. Actually, that's not gonna. Yeah, that's gonna matter. Oh, oh, great. Up sensitivity. How do you penetrate me? But I can penetrate him. Uh, other guy, that was a good angle. Oh wow, that's a lot of guys. Fire his gun. A critical, I must say, is strike. Oh, oh yes, show me your sight. I'm showing you my front. Yeah. She luck on. Ow. Uh, angle? Ah, oh, he got me. Don't know why. I don't know why he shot me though. Yeah, he's gone. All right, sorry about that. Uh, d you know, sorry about that. DX story kind of cut out for no reason, uh, or reason I could find. This is a new install DX story, by the way. But yeah, now it's on to the third part. Now, uh, yeah, when I, I was doing person with the T2 light, as you can see, the T2 light does less damage, less penetration, higher rate of fire, higher turret traverse, which is what more or less the fr first tier two to actually beat the uh, T45. Gun depression is actually is better. Gun elevation is actually better. Uh, aim time is better.
better than the T45. And Spursion is is worse. It, yeah, it's worse than the T45. Our damage per minute is much better than the uh, T45. Durability is higher than T45. Remember, the T2I is your is your is your main fast tank. The reason why people get T2 lights is for their speed, and yet it has more health than T45. It has less armor than T45 does, which makes sense. It has much higher engine power, of course. Much much higher specific impulse, which is rare. Uh, much insanely higher top speed. Higher, higher, higher reverse speed. Higher, or oh, almost as high to reverse speed, but ending and that's matching and hard, and that's hard thing to match. And concealment is about the same, with the T2, with the T2 light being worse. U range, it is worse than the T45, which is odd because the T2 light really is only good at either flanking things to death really hard or scouting. Um, mostly run scouting instead of seeing one spot and scouting. Or, well, I can just run to a spot, sit, and then scout, but anyway. Um, uh, and then signal range is higher than the T45. Alright, so, um, now let's do another match. Yeah, but overall, I really, really like this thing. Again, you know, people, or not again, but people, uh, you know, if, if you have been following Wolf Tanks, um, you know, there are people that have been complaining about, oh, tier two and tier three gift tanks are terrible. They're only worth they're only worth the garage lot. Uh, I think wargaming is made up for their is made up for the transgressions with this thing, because this thing's just amazing. Um, uh, it is, it, in my book, it is almost as good as the T twenty six. And it's Russian, that's the funny thing, it's Russian. I usually don't compliment Russian things all that much. Uh, and I don't, I'm usually not taken back by Russian things all that much. But this thing, however, I actually do like it a lot. It's not a bad tank. Uh, it's really good, in fact. Um, so, yeah. And, you know me, me complimenting Russian stuff is rare, if I ever do it. And usually I have to get my leg pulled in order to do it. Um, which, actually, is the funny, that's, another, uh, that's the funny thing with that. It's actually... Like, it's actually, like, the third, like, my third biggest viewer base is actually in Russia. Or, third or fourth biggest viewer base is actually in Russia, which is interesting. Um, so yeah. I mean, you know, when I, when I talk back about Russian stuff, I talk about stuff, not their people. Um, the people are excellent. All people, all people of the world are excellent. It's just... The stuff that the government makes for their wars is kind of, uh, um, I mean, but they do make cool stuff every now and then, like, a Kur like the Kurnov sub, uh, you got the A94, which never was made, or was, it never was really made, but you got the, oh, uh, you got their, you got their super carriers, which are just funny, because they're, are escort carriers with a lot, they're, they're assault carriers with tons of guns, um, they're not guns, but missiles, I mean. And they get the Russian B1, which is really cool. So, yeah. Uh-oh, we're going against tier 3s. Good thing we got the gun for it. And the armor, kind of. Oh, and BT... And there's a BT... BT there's a BT7 artillery on their team. That's not good. You can one-shot us! Three times over! Alright, here we go. Should we make a break for the hill? Uh, we'll see where it goes. But I mean, I mean, don't worry. I don't like British or French. I don't like British or French stuff at all. Pretty much. Oh, well. Areas are cool, and French makes some cool stuff every now and then. Um, we're going to the hill, and that's time. I won't know if that. I want to speak in their native language or the native language of the vehicle. Here we go. Man, yeah, this turret design is kind of in of both a T-34 turret design and a KV-1 turret design, isn't it? I just noticed that right now, so... 
Yeah. Can we hold the hill all by ourselves? I would hope so. Let's hope none. Oh, let's hope! Well, it looks like most of them went down to G9 or D8, so that's good. This thing in hills. I mean, the specific impulse on this thing is pretty good for its tier. But it's still not amazing. Uh-oh! He did something! Oh, fine! Oh, great, great, great! A Vince Minobus! A Vince Minobus! Oh, great. We don't reverse fast. He missed! Why is he going to rim me? Bonk! Oh, we killed him with ram! Yeah, he won that by strictly having more health than me. Yeah, that's bad! He can one shot half our team! Three times over. Well, that was unfortunate, and we are out of time. Um, yeah, we're out of time. We can go on no, another match. So I'll be, we'll go back to the garage, and I'll and I'll be back and give you my final thoughts. So once we're in the garage, I'll be right back. Okay, let's see how much we actually. Let's see how much we got in both battles. Alright, uh, let's do a classic wolf thanks for me, so let's look at the first battle first, why not? Instead of looking at it after, but yeah. So for, uh, in that battle we got 3,400 credits and 122 experience, no, without premium. And we did 96 damage. You can get more in a tier 1 tank. I bet then you had to do well in a tier 1 tank. That was, how many shots did I fire? Uh, shot. I, I fired four shots with two of them hit, or two of them hit and pinned. So, yeah. Um, and a tier one tank, you have to do a whole lot more than that uh, in order to do it, in order to get that much money. So, yeah, that, that's a good that's a good reason to keep this thing around. Because I could play a whole lot and get money like that so I can buy some stuff from my OI. And you got Heaven's Door Twitch. What do we got? We're doing pretty well, or at least I thought we did pretty well. We got 4,637 credits and one and 241 experience for 101 damage, which is a shot and a ram. Uh, so that was actually pretty, that's, that's actually not bad. So yeah, you're actually doing good in this tank. Uh, probably be worth your time to play. So yeah, I mean, that's the thing, uh, that's, like, that's the thing about premium, that's the thing about gift tanks, is sure, you sell the thing, you get a garage shot, which that means you can get the thing that you actually want. However, there are two flaws in that. One is the gift tank may never ever come back for any reason, and you might feel really bad, you might feel really bad later on selling it and seeing someone else have it. And, have it and see someone else haven't actually do well in it or just or you might counter someone saying oh i wish i had a t44 a t45 and you said oh i sold mine and he's like what why would you do something so dumb uh so you got that then you, then you can also show it off in game and friends you know have fun with it another thing is it actually makes money uh you know, actually makes credits because it's super easy. It should be cheap to run. It doesn't make credits on its own in terms of how much money it makes per shot and spot. However, it does. It is cheap to run. Let me look at the service real quick. I never do this, but let's look at the service real quick and look at its price of ammunition. Fourteen per shot. You need three thousand. We don't fire that many shots in this thing. So we can't even carry that much ammo in our tank, which you know that's fine because most because tanks up to uh, let's look at my OI real quick. It's a it's a it's a, it's not a good example, but it does, it is it gets the it will drive the point home. Why? What is how much rounds do your how much do your hundred uh, how much do your hundred million rounds cost? Two fifty. Okay. And he's a t and he's a tier six and that's hundred millimeter two six. And you make like forty-five thousand. So yeah. How about Mister uh, Typhoon Nine Pen? You, to, you, you, sir, are tier eight. How much money do you? How much uh, credits do your shots have? How many shots make? 
Jerry the Sing makes like 80, 90,000, 70, 80, 90,000 per game. And I'm bad at the tank. I'm bad at using, I'm bad at using 90 millimeters of high tiers. I'm used, I'm used, I'm, I know I'm better at using 100, 105s and 120s at high tiers. It makes, it, it, it shot cost 350, or 305. So yeah. So his shots got a little bit more, and that in the OI, remember OI is using a much bigger gun, and it's a tier six. So yeah. And that's what the revolution is. I use a bigger gun. Be more fair to OI. Five hundred eighty. This thing makes roughly the same amount of credit as the Type Ninety Nine does, but easier. So yeah, now you can see. And that's the thing about low tier tanks, is they're just so cheap to run. Um, so, if you're really desperate for money, and you can't even shield your... And if you... Basically, if your gift tanks are the only things you can have. And they're the only premium tanks you have. You should keep them. Make money in. If you don't want to go back and play with tier 1s. And, again, tier 1s, you still gotta do really well in order to get any... In order to get the... In order to get money that you easily get in the in a low tier premium tank. So yeah. You don't have a tier one on my account, do I? Oh yes I do have a I have this thing. You how much money do your rounds cost? Oh right yeah they are dirt cheap they're cheap because they're cheaper than their they cost nothing. Yeah tier ones cost nothing to run. Tier two premiums cost something to run but they're they're cheap. Um actually do I get tier twos normals? Actually yeah I do. No, I don't. I sold the uh, chick one. Uh, but you, but you get the point. Yeah, you should keep your, you should keep your low tier premiums for, if nothing else, looking cool. And if you want to keep them for something, keep them for making money if you really need it, or just having fun? Question mark. Like people do that these days. Uh, in multiplayer games. And also, I didn't get, I didn't show the Volvo around view of this thing yet. So yeah, so what I think of the type, uh, not type, uh, T45. It's in the same league as the T26. All of you that have been waiting for a good GIF tank to come out, you found one, and it's finally arrived. Uh, in this thing. Because this thing is just amazing. And it's Russian too, when you issue like your Russian tanks. Uh, you know, I like it. You know, it's Russian. I mean, I like the T73. Even though it's Russian, I like the, what, T... 43? Even though it's Russian. I like... Yeah, well, let's go to another category. I like the Type 59 pen. Even though it's Chinese. Well, half of it is in way. No, the Type 59. I like it, even though it's Chinese. But I like it because everyone loves such a thing. Mostly. And it is a fun thing. You know, it's a fun, fun thing, you know, in its own regard. But anyway. Uh, but anyway, so yeah. Uh, if you have... If you've been needing to come back to play Wolf Tanks, this is a good reason for it. Just come back, play a win a battle, and you get it. Because remember, unlike the... Uh, well, unlike the T uh, something combat car and the T twenty six when they first come out, I think for that for another anniversary of all, uh for anniversary uh yeah, there was it was either it was for anniversary of Wolf Tanks or like I think T twenty six was first first year anniversary of uh Wolf Tanks but e either way either Wolf Tanks of Wargaming. Uh you didn't have to do anything you just had to have a cannon and they put it in your garage some other tanks play a game. I forgot which ones you do, but you had to play a game. Like, maybe the BT-73 you to play a game with. I have, I have, uh, videos on the T-26, obviously, because I, you know, start off, I got b videos on everything, but LTP, EM-3 Lite, uh, yeah, that's basically it. So, yeah, I might link them in the description, too, for reference sake. But, yeah, um, yeah, uh, that's a really good reason to come play. And remember, you have to win a battle, so uh, keep that in mind. Um, you know, don't start the game expecting to get it in your garage after that. Like if you're playing on the 15th, or if you're one, or if it's like you decide, oh, I won't play, oh, I won't get this tank, but uh, but I only want to play one game. Make sure you win, because uh, you don't get this thing otherwise. Um, so yeah, um, all right, so yeah, pretty good tank. Um, again, it's in the league of T26. And BT7 and Tittery, which is amazing. Oh, that's time. We've gone on for like 40 minutes now. So, um, yeah, be here for this video. Thanks for watching. Do if you should go back up watching on this video. Please let me know if you want me to leave a comment. If you have any suggestions for the series, what I should look at next. 
Also, we'll have a Twitter, by the way, in which I tweet out channel updates on, uh, channel updates as well as news about games I am doing, we'll be doing or have done, as well as, um, news and you're going to see my Now, I do tweet out, I'll probably be, uh, when I get it done for tonight, I'll probably tweet out, uh, telling you about this tank, uh, so yeah. Um, when I do, you know, when I, when, and when a new premium comes in the store or returns, I do try to tweet it off if I remember to, because, you know, me and Zyping are not, are not the best friends, so yeah. And Twitter's not the best friend either, so yeah, but I try. Um, so yeah, that is up. If you're interested in following me, go on there. Alright, so, um, yep, that'll be it for this video, and I guess, see you in the skin.